Hi friends, it's Courtney from Foster Church. I hope you're doing wonderfully today. I have our April pre-K story to read to you. This month, our memory verse is children, obey your parents in everything. And this comes from Colossians chapter three, verse 20. So let's say that together. Children, obey your parents in everything. Colossians 3, 20. Very good job. Our message is that I am a part of a family. You are a part of a family. We are all a part of a family. That's what we're talking about today. This is our message for April. So let's get right into our story. See David, the shepherd boy. See David's sheep. See the new lamb. David shows love to the little lamb. He pets the lamb. Come sheep, David calls. See the sheep coming to David. The sheep come to David. He shows love to them. David shows love for his sheep. He leads them to a pool of water. The sheep drink water. Let's say a prayer together now. Thank you, God. You love David. You teach him to show love for the sheep. Help me to show love to others today. Amen. Very nice. Let's keep going with our story now. David shows love for his sheep. He finds good grass. The sheep eat the good grass. Yum, yum. The sheep like the good grass. David plays his harp. The sheep like to hear his music. Look out, David. <gasps> A lion is after your sheep. <sighs> the lion is hungry. Shoo, lion. David chases the lion. Oh, David shows love for his sheep. He saved them. <gasps> oh, no, look out, David. A bear is after your sheep. <sighs> the bear is hungry. Shoo, bear. David chases a bear. David shows love for his sheep. He keeps them safe. Come sheep, time to go home, David calls. The sheep follow David. They love David. He helps them find grass and he shows love for his sheep. We can show love too. We show love when we care for our pets and we show love to others when we are kind to them. I like that story. I love how much he loves his sheep and how they trust him and follow him. That's how we are with Jesus. Jesus takes care of us. He gives us grass and water, keeps us safe from bears and lions by giving us the Bible and prayer, a way to talk to him and chases away bad things. And we can always pray to God to help us to feel safe and confident. And he loves to take care of us that way. And that's how we are a part of a family. We are all part of God's family. And that's why our message is, I am a part of a family, just like his sheep were his family. All right, let's practice our memory verse one more time, friends. Are you ready? Children, obey your parents in everything. Colossians 3.20. Very good, friends. I hope you have a wonderful day and that you enjoyed our story. Bye.